Linger a little longer, making new friendships. Hello, you all. I'm Diana Brienne. Well, I got to thinking tonight about the art of lingering. Now, most people think of lingering as maybe not being a good thing, but lingering can be a very good thing when it's done right. For me, when I leave some place, I tend to linger just a little bit, not too much, but just a little bit. When I go to church and on the way out, my exit is usually kind of slow. I'm not in a hurry like a lot of people are to get, get on with whatever they're doing. I tend to take my time walking out the door. I smile at people, engage in some lighthearted conversation, shake hands, and um, you know, you never know what kind of ideas someone's going to give you, or you might even make a new friend in the process or re-engage with an old friend. But when we rush when we're exiting or even rush when we're entering, often we forego the possibility of connecting with other people. And so for me, if the situation's appropriate and if it's right, um, I tend to linger as often as I can. So if I'm coming out of a restaurant or if I'm coming out of a movie theater, I tend to exit slowly. Sometimes I'll smile at people and I'll say, great movie, wasn't it? Or how did you like the movie? And sometimes that starts up enough of a dialogue there that you never know, you might make an acquaintance at least or, or, or find out some good information about the next movie coming up or a movie they saw that you haven't seen. You know, I learned um, years ago that when you engage in conversation and you listen to people, often you'll gain new insights that you didn't have before. I remember one conversation I had with somebody I never saw again. They told me about the gym that I now belong to. I never saw that person again, but I joined the gym and I love, love, love the gym. And I've had so many great ideas through people that I just casually talk to. Actually, I got a job one time um, because this one woman that I stopped and talked to at a quick stop um, called the place that I wanted to work. And I was just talking to her, a casual conversation, but she happened to know somebody over there and she called and I ended up getting the job. Just through that casual conversation, never saw the woman again. And so I find that when I linger a little bit in the right situations, you know, um, sometimes I can make a new friend, make an acquaintance, or just gain some good insights and information. And, uh, you know, I never am intrusive. I never um, break social barriers. I never um, take, like if someone's professional and they're at work, I don't linger around someone who's doing their job and doing their work. I respect the fact that they've got to focus. So, you know, I pick and choose where I linger and when I linger. And I tend to let, you know, I tend to kind of connect with other people who are lingering as well, not people who are rushing by. Those people are in a hurry for one reason or another and um, missing out on making new friends. And uh, I tend to just kind of connect with people who also want to connect. I smile at people, I engage in light, lighthearted conversation, and um, and I don't stay too long. I, I always, you know, make my exit, but, you know, I just keep enough conversation in there to see if you know, I want to make a future connection. I actually made a friend not too long ago when I was out antiquing and I was um, looking for antiques and I was just standing there and she came up to me and we just started a conversation. Now we go to the movies together and uh, you know, I've just met so many people like that. And sometimes when we're standing around, that's when we meet people. And one day I was standing around because my husband called and I was out antiquing and I didn't see anything. And because I was standing around talking to my husband on the cell phone in the store just for you know a few moments, I happened to gaze over and I saw an antique 1922 radio that I've showed you all in another video that I bought. I wouldn't have seen that had I not been lingering a little longer. So I think lingering done right can be a very, very, very good thing. And um, you know, you gotta use it right. You gotta, you know, respect social guidelines and social boundaries and safety and all that. But for me, I do linger and I find that it has been very rewarding to me. 
So sometimes lingering a little longer can make new friendships. Well, I hope you subscribe to my YouTube channel and I hope to talk to you all soon again. So from my house to your house, God bless you and I'll talk to you then. Bye-bye.